what is up guys welcome back to another video you guys already know it's a weekly thing by now but unfortunately it's the last time you'll get to see this for the rest of the summer summer shootout race day rounds eight and nine on tuesday it's currently sunday august the 8th heading down just gonna chill tonight uh tomorrow the bandos are racing two races me and ethan you already know gonna be spotting for kingston we each get a race hopefully we can lead kingston at two w's and then of course me and ethan racing on tuesday two races hope to both finish top three in points get two w's to close out the uh summer shootout but uh excited ready to go we're gonna get down to charlotte at a decent time this week so that's exciting and we're staying at one of our favorite hotels the courtyard so that is also very exciting but this week gonna be a great one summer shootout you already know let's go just made it to charlotte but the night has taken a turn for the worse um so i went to check into the hotel and once again for like the 15th straight week there's been a whole spaz about oh you're not 21 you're not an adult okay first off I'm, i can vote i'm 18 i'm an adult thank you second off we went to jack in the box and i got nuggets and fries and i was really hungry because i've not ate in a while um and then I forgot my nuggets, so I just get fries, and they're cold and soggy, so kind of sad, no cap, but you know what? It's not about the size and the fight of the dolphin, it's about the size of the dolphin and the fight. But uh, I'm wore out, gonna get some sleep, gonna starve to death. Kingston's race day tomorrow, gonna spot him to two wins. And my uh, Somerset Briar Jumper shirt, good night vlog. Dolphin out. Good morning vlog. We are here. Concord Mills Mall. Same thing every week. You already know. I'm going to literally call it right here right now. We're going to go in here. We're going to go to Lionel. We're going to get the newest die cast. Then we're going to go eat at the food court. Kingston's going to ask the worker if they um, have pork sandwiches at the fine eating establishment. And then we're going to end up going to VLK. Uh, Ethan's going to win. I'm going to finish second. Kingston's going to finish third. And then we're going to go to the racetrack, and Kingston's going to finish second in both races today because he can't because he can't stay on the bottom coming off of turns one and two. Your boy out here is still looking like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. It's a great day to be alive. Save the Dolphins. Um, help them out. Help a wreck. Hey. Yep. Uh, but we're going to go in here and uh, probably get some Dolphin T-shirts because that's the new word for the week, Dolphins. I don't know why. How do you feel about Dolphins? Chicken. Who knows? Chicken. Let's go. Uh, week in the life just kidding race day for kingston mall time yes sir post lionel hall you already know we had to go absolutely insane with the die cast ethan got some other ones as well how you feel go great. great yep yep uh blow our money in lionel now we're what are we gonna do kingston um i don't know what i'm gonna do i don't know probably just gonna chill out wait for kingston's race tonight maybe walk around the mall go into some more stores who knows but i'm excited ready to go but just want to show you guys the die cast hall but more fun to come uh, instant regret ladies and gentlemen walking out of the mall now me and ethan i guess everybody went crazy today so obviously you know i went crazy in lionel and then we also ended up going back into lionel and getting each other a surprise die cast and that kind of kicked off the whole man cave thing yeah, he bought me a shirt and a I don't even know what you, like an NFL little like mini figure. I don't know. Mystery figure. Yeah, mystery, like mystery figure. Die Just like the mystery die cast. And then I got him a Mustang shirt. I'll show you guys this shirt when we get out of the uh, out in the parking lot. Because the shirt that I'm wearing or I got is pretty fire. Uh, Lane, y'all got a bunch of poppets and stuff at five below. And Kingston got a chair because Kingston's a practical guy. But, um, you know, our credit cards are in pain right now, but it's the last time we're ever going to see each other. So it's worth that it. We had to go crazy. But uh, this is going to probably be the last time I'm going to vlog for a while. The next time you'll see me is definitely at the track, probably for this kid's race. Yeah, you'll see me in three Yep, yep. All right, Somerset, Briar, Jumpers, Ethan with the, what does this shirt even say? J. J. M. Robinson Bulldog. He's a Bulldog, baby, just like I am about to be moving on Saturday. Going to be a Gardner Webb Bulldog. He's a J. M. Robinson Bulldog. Also, go check out the new TikTok. Uh, by the time this video is out, I will have posted a TikTok. Um, I'm starting this new thing after buying the J.M. Robinson shirt and after buying two, two Somerset High School shirts um, a couple weeks ago in Kentucky. I'm inspired. I want more high school t-shirts. Help me out. How you doing? But uh, qualifying, all that Thank coming you. up. 
All right, just get out of the track. Kingston won both races to no one's surprise. Uh, we're about to go into where? Any? No. Yeah, we're going to Chick Fil A. Uh, excited, very hungry. Gonna eat some nice dinner, and then I guess go back to the hotel room and chill tonight. I'm excited. Vibes. Might take a shower tonight because pretty wore out, honestly. Everyone, go uh, drop a comment. Hashtag pray for Ethan. Not feeling the best right now. Well, I'm feeling fine. His body is just breaking down on him. Um, it's hard to explain. Yeah, he, his leg or something is hurting him really bad. So, no, everyone, uh, everyone, go pray for Ethan. I'm sure he'd really appreciate that. But um, going into Chick Fil A, gonna get some grub. I'll probably vlog maybe once more tonight before tomorrow's activities. But I'm hungry. All right, this is uh, this can be my good night vlog clip. Uh, me and Ethan, he's currently sanitizing his hands. Uh, we're just chilling. Not really done much this evening. Actually, we kind of have. It started off kind of slow once we got back to the hotel. Kind of just laid here in silence. And then, I don't know, we just started going downstairs, getting snacks in the lobby and stuff. Talked to Kingston and Lanyell for a little bit. Called a bunch of people because we got some exciting things in the works, actually. Special announcement. But that's uh, that's for another day, another video. You guys will be hearing about that all on all social media platforms soon. Actually, major announcement. Life-changing. But um, that's me all for tonight. We're going to get some sleep um, because tomorrow, I guess actually now today because it's past midnight, is uh, rounds 9 and 10 for the summer shootout. Obviously, round 8 got evaporated into thin water. There's no such thing as round 8 of the 2021 summer shootout anymore. So two more rounds, rounds 9 and 10, to close out the summer and it's series, very excited, hoping me and Ethan can finish not only top five in points, because we're both fifth in points right now, but hopefully well inside the top five in points. But that's going to be all for us tonight. We're going to get some sleep. Very exciting day tomorrow, because it's going to be the last time we're ever going to see each other. So we're going to make it big. We're going to go big or go home. Dolphin. Good morning, vlog. Back at it again. Summer shootout race day, rounds 9 and 10 for the final time. Repping the TWR merch. Getting ready to go, getting packed up. About to leave the hotel, gonna get some grub. Probably just relax and enjoy the day because for Ethan, this is the last day of summer for him because he starts school tomorrow at Southwestern. And then obviously this will probably be the last time we see each other for a good minute, which is kind of sad. But uh, yeah, slept good, getting packed up. Um, excited, ready to go. Should be a beautiful day of racing. Hopefully get two wins and finish strong in the points. But uh, excited about today. Obviously, you guys are going to see all the action. So stay tuned. But it's going to be a good one. All right. Just got out of the Panera Bread restaurant. Uh, pretty good food. Uh, they gave me a lot, actually. I got like a half Caesar salad and a half macaroni. But yet it was like huge plates. And I asked for chips. And they gave me two baguettes. I didn't pray for it, but they gave it to me anyway. So hopefully I'll get a better race day today along with that. But uh, we're here with Ethan and Laney Bob, chicken. You guys already know. Also, TikTok has just been posted. Go check it out. Comment your high school for a shout out. It really mean a lot. But where are we going now, Lane Yell? Crumble cookies. We're going to go to Crumble Cookies. Very excited. Going to get, Hello. I normally get uh, only four cookies, but I think I'm going to get eight this week. I think I'm going to get a box of four for Hello. me and Abby to split and then my the rest of my family to fend for themselves. But very excited the next time you'll see us crumble cookie review ah dang man i feel horrible right now uh we went to i don't know if i told you guys i can't remember really even remember but went to a uh, park in mecklenburg and ran bat played basketball the whole time I, I ran 1v1 with a kid he was super nice i ended up winning and i ran twos 2v2s with some other kids and uh we lost barely but I think it was just fatigue got to us. It's literally 95 right now. Feels like 100 according to weather.com. My nose is not doing any better either. Still horribly summer. I'm exhausted. Now just trying to like physically recover before tonight's race is like two biggest races of the whole summer. And I'm in here just cobbing it up like about to pass out. But anywho, I'm here with Ethan. He just got his wristbands. Chicken. We're going to go into the racetrack, do our thing. I'll see y'all after qualifying. Just wrapped up quali, uh, not good, not good at all. Um, P7 for race one and then P, should be P8 for race two. So, I mean, it was a definitely, definitely disappointing run for sure. Really thought we'd get up in the top three there and lay down two fast laps, but unfortunately it just wasn't meant to be. But um, 
we know what we got to do better. We know what to fix for the two races coming up. So I'm excited. Um, should be able to just roll the bottom race one, just roll the bottom and then race two, of course, starting on the outside. But it's all about points today coming in. We're fifth in points. I think we're only like seven, seven back to third and fourth. They're tied. It's really close. So, I mean, in theory, I mean, to get the championship, it's still in reach, but it'd be, we're going to need a lot of help with that. But to get a top three in points is definitely more in reach. So that's what I'm mainly shooting for tonight. If I can get a top three in points, that's all that matters because I feel like all summer we've been a top three car. But um, that's all I have to say in regards to qualifying. Getting ready for the race coming up. Excited. And uh, we'll let you know how it goes. But see you after race. Okay, it's like late at night now. It's been raining for like hours. Me and Ethan even went and got Chick-fil-A. It's so late in the night now. We're here with Laney Bob. Laney Bob's excited. It's Hey, little bear. Abby, what do you think about this? Yay. Are you excited that it could go up until like 2 or 3 in the morning? I'm very excited. Oh, yeah. It's not like she has to babysit or anything tomorrow. She's good. Kingston, how do you feel? What? I want a pork sandwich. He wants a pork sandwich. Yes, I know. Yeah, but I don't know if we'll get to race tonight. Well, we, we will probably, but we just got to wait for the weather. But you guys will be updated all right so we are here with cameron you remember from, me <laughs> yeah he's back from his cruise you guys are probably so confused right now my hair is way shorter because i got a haircut um it's currently thursday morning at 2 a.m the race ended tuesday night at like midnight i guess so we're gonna give you a race recap and close out this video so uh started seventh like i said long green flag run to start the race 17 lap green flag run Worked way up to fifth, was running really good. And then on the restart, chose the high side, got up to fourth. And then on the restart, shot it to my new bear that Cameron got me from the cruise. Yes, sir. But on the restart, uh, the car in second and the car running third made contact. And then they shot back up into me uh, in turn one and two, knocked me up in the air, or the back end up in the air, slammed back down on the ground. Car's pretty tore up, not going to lie, which sucks. And we have ended up finishing like 23rd. And... We lost our top five in points. We ended up finishing sixth in points, which is not accurate of how we ran all year at all. Actually, as a matter of fact, we ran up front all summer, had a chance to win many races, or just had really good finishes and then got wrecked most of the time running up front. But it's a semi-pros for you. That's how it do be. But uh, overall, good summer. Got my first shootout win. Happy about that, obviously, and all the good runs we put together. But that's me yet for this week's video. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. What's the last thing, Cam? God bless.